told you, I have nothing to- Did I say you could talk? Did someone give you permission to open your sorry little mouth? No! So sit down, shut up, and listen. We know that apartment's yours, Bob. We know that Hannah was held hostage there, which means I can nail you for kidnapping. That's 20 years easy. What? No. But you I... know what? I'm not going to stop there. I am going to fry you for murder. Wait, me? I didn't kill her. Don't lie to me. You locked her up. You held her hostage. Who does that to someone that they love? You lying sack of... We weren't in love, okay? It was a lie. The whole thing was a lie. There was no relationship. Hannah and I were never even together. What? what? We only did it for the ratings. The ratings? Ashley and Stone's engagement was sucking up all the attention on the show. Penelope's screen time was dropping, which was killing her clothing sales. She was out of her mind. So we came up with a plan. Hannah was reluctant at first, but Penelope can be pretty persuasive. So the $5,000 that Penelope was paying Hannah, that was to fake a relationship? We never intended for it to end like this. <sighs> what happened, Bob? The other night, after taping her confession, Hannah said she needed to talk. Well, the three of us couldn't be seen together, so we met at the apartment. She told us she couldn't bear everyone thinking she was this homewrecker. She couldn't go on living a lie. Yeah, she said she was going to go public. Reveal the affair had been faked all along. That's a pretty big bombshell. How'd you guys take it? How'd we take it? We panicked. If we let her go through with it, it would blow up the show. We'd lose all credibility. No one would buy Penelope's clothes anymore. Plus, we'd be in breach of contract, and the show could sue us for every cent we had. Our whole lives would be ruined. So then you guys tied her up. We didn't know what to do. So a whole day went by. We realized we couldn't hold her forever. So we made a call. So who'd you call? Bob, who'd you call? Peter Monroe. The Wives of Wall Street producer. Man, we needed help. It's his show. He had as much to lose as we did. What did you tell him? Everything. Then he came over and told Penelope and me to leave, that he would handle Hannah. Well, we thought he was just going to talk some sense into her, you know, maybe sweeten her deal. But the next thing we knew, Hannah was dead. <laughs> 